is the two schools of thought of is the AI bubble more like 08 or is the AI bubble more like dot com? I would say probably dot com because you know um, the the underlying asset under like the mortgage crisis was the underlying asset is a cash producing business right. versus homes aren't cash producing right so um, and also they can be resold and, and actually have equipment in them um, so I I think this is rather she doesn't understand you can either have a lot of cash flow at the beginning of a business or you yeah. can grow you know and you can't really do both at the same time. Yeah, it's a good point, and, I, and I'm going to just tag on to that as well. Did we have kind of a huge run-up and overvaluation and issues with the emergence of the Internet? Of course. Yeah, nobody debates that. The Internet didn't go away, and most companies, like Amazon's the prime example, showed that that technology actually ended up being a huge net contributor to the economy, and many companies survived that, that bubble and, and came out of it. So to what degree is there an AI bubble? Is it going to burst? Well, I don't know exactly. Are some companies going to run into being over leveraged? I think that's almost unavoidable. But the underlying technology is without a doubt contributing to the economy and pointing to it as, as, as being negative cash flow is well, another really thing, just nonsense.